What's up, you guys? Idiot Fliptronics. So I'm going to be helping you guys out if you're locked out of your uh, iPhone 7 or iPhone 7 Plus. So this typically happens when you forgot the passcode, which is, uh, you know, frustrating, um, especially if, uh, you know, you just can't remember it. So there's one thing that you guys can do to uh, get back into it that works really well, but you're going to lose your data unless you already have it, um, you know, saved on iCloud or the uh, PC or Mac that you're using. But what you guys want to do is um, get ready to plug your iPhone into iTunes. So have iTunes loaded up on a PC or Mac. Then you want to make sure that your iPhone's plugged in. Uh, at this point, what you guys want to do is uh, get your iPhone into recovery mode. So this is going to, um, it's pretty easy. What you got to do is, uh, you know, turn your iPhone off. Then what you want to do is hold down the home and power button. So uh, when you have your iPhone off, um, you want to hold both of these. And then when you see the Apple logo turn on, I'll do a quick example for you guys. I'm not going to be able to get this into recovery mode just because I don't have it plugged into iTunes, but I'll show you what to do. All right, so what you want to do is, uh, you know, hold both of these buttons simultaneously. And then when the Apple logo pops up, you're going to want to release um, the, home, the power button and continue holding down the home button. So at this point, like I said, you want to continue holding down the uh, home button. That way it'll put it into recovery mode. Um, as soon as you guys do that, you're going to get an option on your PC or Mac to restore your iPhone. So this is where you're going to lose your data, um, but it'll restore your iPhone as new, so you'll be able to get back into it, which is uh, you know pretty much what you're trying to do. So um, that is what you guys can do if you're locked out of your iPhone 7 or iPhone 7 Plus. Like I said, it's kind of a bummer because um, you're going to have to you know put all your stuff back onto it, but if you already have it saved on a PC or Mac uh, that you've been using, then it's not going to be that big of an issue. But um, that's pretty much it, you guys. So hopefully that helps you guys out. Uh, as always, stay tuned for more. Please like this video, share it, and be sure to subscribe to our channel.